South Korean researchers have developed a way of looking at CT scans and MRIs in 3D without the need for special glasses. Artificial intelligence converts two-dimensional images of the body into 3D, which will enable doctors to fi better find and analyze tumors and lesions. And by following the user's eye movements, it's hands-free, so it can be used even during surgery. Ian Jin has the details. X-rays, CT scans, and MRI scans are a few of the crucial imaging technologies that have been used by doctors to find and monitor diseases. But because these images are only available in two dimensions, it leaves room for errors in identifying tumors or the size of lesions. Now researchers in South Korea have developed a way to advance this technology into the third dimension. An AI algorithm learns the images from CT or MRI scans and in just a couple of minutes automatically converts the information into a three-dimensional model. When we look at a CT or MRI image in two dimensions, say it's a cancerous tumor, it's difficult to grasp its complete form. We've incorporated AI technology that can learn these images and project an optimized 3D hologram. And this new technology works without the need for special glasses. One of the drawbacks of working with holograms was that they could only be seen from certain angles. With the latest technology, the hologram follows the viewer's eyes and also allows control of the holographic images just by the movement of the user's hand or head. In the medical field, this means hologram imaging can be used easily even during surgery. By incorporating artificial intelligence, the three-dimensional holographic display system recognizes the user's position and actions and automatically synchronizes the contents. These researchers have transferred this latest technology to small and medium-sized businesses here in Korea, where joint research will continue towards further developing an optimized environment for surgery. When the time comes for this technology to be commercialized, we can expect surgeries to have a higher rate of success. Yoon Jin, Arirang News.